The first reports of a fire reached the Spanish emergency services just after 1.30 in the morning, with concerns mounting as it neared residential areas. A section of the A7 motorway was temporarily closed to prevent people from travelling towards the fire, with the electricity to the area also cut off. Around 400 people were evacuated from hotels and estates, among them Gibraltarians on holiday and those with homes in Manilva. Obviously, I was, I was very worried. I had my children with me as well in the house. So my priority was to just to get out, really, just get, get, get whatever on and get the, my passport and, and just uh, leave as soon as we could. Because obviously, there was obviously the risk as well that the smoke, the, the roads can close as well. They can close the, the roads and, and they'll trap you in. I was lying in bed and I suddenly heard men shouting in Spanish, hola, hola. Hello, get up, uh, there's a fire right close to you. You have to evacuate the house. So I rushed out, and when I first I looked out of the window, and the houses behind us had a red glow, so I knew it was pretty close. So my husband and I went outside, and uh, we alerted the neighbours behind us, and then we came back, and there was a volunteer. The fire brigade hadn't took a long time to arrive, I have to say. So then he said, oh, the garden next door is very dry. They haven't been there all year. And that was actually on fire. The garden next door was on fire. So we rushed over there with my hose and we extinguished that. But then the police came and told us we had to go. When I went up to the road to watch it, I was keeping an eye on one thing, which is that the sparks don't cross the outer pizza. Because had the sparks gone over and started a fire on this side, then I would have been concerned. And the other concern was that this fire was put out about 50 meters away from a petrol station. So we were also concerned that, you know, if we got the petrol station, we would definitely have to leave because that is not far. We have a WhatsApp group uh, with all the neighbours and they were all sharing photos saying, get out the house, you need to get out, there's a fire. Yeah. Um, and just the whole of the camper was just alight. So I came back in and I was just, I was just shaking. I saw the neighbour downstairs, he was knocking on the door. He's like, are you OK? You need to get out, get out now. Got both kids, car seat, got the dogs on the lead and just got out as soon as we could. I was absolutely shaking. It was so scary. It was the scariest thing that's ever happened to me. The Manilva fire followed on the heels of another blaze this weekend in the area around Tarifa. On Saturday, the chief minister, Fabian Picardo, offered the Gibraltar government's assistance to the area, describing the fire as worrying for all of us in the region.